Hello, and shout out to my one subscriber, which I've just had. Goals. Okay, so today I'll be speaking English because I'm reacting to a Korean drama called Him <clears throat> in English. The English title is Flower Crew Joseon Marriage Agency. And basically, I watch it in Korean but with English subtitles, so that's why I'm right, I'm speaking English. It's gonna be a lot of fun, okay? It's gonna be a lot of fun. I've already watched the first two episodes, and honestly, there was so much to say about them, but I figured I was gonna watch, I was gonna figure out if I wanted to keep watching it, and I do, so I'm gonna keep watching it. And basically, this is gonna be a series uh, where I'm going to react to like every single episode. There's only 16 episodes, and I already watched two. So we're going in with episode three today, and then we'll see. I'll every time I watch an episode from now on, I'll be reacting to that episode. Unless there's just nothing to react to, then that'll be it. Um. Some of the stretches where I like don't have comments won't be included because that's not as fun, <laughs> I suppose. So let's get started, I guess. I haven't done, a, I didn't do a recap of the last two episodes that I watched without reacting to it, and I figured that that would probably be a good idea to do, or at least to like give some background knowledge so that I'm not the only person who totally knows what's happening. Um, basically, the main characters we have, oh dear, the main characters that we have are Lee Su, who's like not that big of a main character, but he turns out to be the king he becomes the king somehow. It's very confusing. I'll get to that. He wants to marry Ge Dong. And they're just like regular people when they know each other. And then we have uh, three matchmakers. And basically these are like the five main characters of this entire show. We have uh, like the matchmakers names aren't really that important. But um, basically, Lee Su wants to marry Ge Dong, she wants to marry him, so they go to these three matchmakers to make the wedding happen. And then, like, on the wedding day, on their wedding day, um, Lee Su is like, oh, but I forgot this thing at home, so I'm just quickly gonna run home and grab it. Uh, it's for the wedding. And everybody's like, oh, okay, it's fine. It's like, it's close. Just be here on time. And then basically he gets kidnapped. And then his father is like, oh, it's taking long. I'll go check up on him. And so he does. And he finds out that his son has been kidnapped. And then he, of course, goes looking for him. I mean, I get that. That's normal. Um... He finds out that he's probably been kidnapped by people from the palace, which is true. Um, but then, instead of going to back to the wedding to like inform people of what has happened, he's just like, screw these people, we're waiting for him at the wedding. Especially screw Gedong, who's just waiting and waiting. I'ma just chase my son. And go to the palace. I have a lot of hate for the father. Like, after episode one and two, I just decided that all bad things that happen will be because of him. Like, even if it's not, he will have a role to play in it. I just know it. Because he's literally such a bad guy. Like, 
He doesn't contact anybody. He doesn't tell anybody what's happening. He even meets a person, like, while he's on the way to the palace. He even meets a person who's like, oh, hey, I'm on the way to your son's wedding. This is too many details, but I need to vent on this dad. Oh, hey, I'm on the way to your son's wedding. Do you want to go together? And the father doesn't even react to it. He's just like, can I borrow your horse? Like, oh, dear. Like, come on, dude. Anyway, he has a stone face through the most through most of the time. Like, he doesn't really show emotion for any reason that is a good reason. Like, no. So yeah, there's a lot of hate going on from my side for that, and I think that that's okay because he's a shitty character. Anyway, so. Lee Su became, becomes the king, and everyone thinks that he ran away from Gedong, even though he was actually kidnapped. And now she's working for the matchmakers because she owes them money because of her wedding, which makes sense. And there's a lot of stuff going on there. Actually, uh, the father, who's the shitty father, who I will be calling an asshole every time I see his face on screen, is not actually the actual father of Lee Su. It turns out he's just the adoptive father, and that Lee Su's actual father is the king, so he's a legitimate heir. That's all well and fine. Yeah. And that was it. Now that was it. I'm finished. Moving on. See if this is a total failure or not. I've never tried this. Anyway, it's a lot of fun. Chazara. This is kind of, does this look like a nobleman's house? No, it does not, under any circumstances, look like a nobleman's house. Okay, it's like the most rundown place ever. <laughs> You see what I mean? This is like a super rundown place. I'm from Flamia, Japan. Nega, wait, what are you doing? Nika, this is Nina. Take a sign, I guess. Hi, Papa. Show Kim Suchan and go to watch. That's her fiance who ran away from her. It's just kind of a big deal. You only go to the city, it's Nina. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
아니다. 갈근탕도 함께 올리라 해라. 대전의 말입니까, 마마? 나 말이다. 나, 저쪽 말고 나. 예, 마마. 내일 오늘 일로 두도록 하겠습니다. 의수상 게 아무래도 없는 것만 같다. 세상에. 집판이 나. 봐봐. 보고 있어요. 나이가 들수록 챙겨 먹어야 한다니까. She is so like all the time. 개똥아, 부부가 왜 둘인 줄 알아? 서로에게 짐 하나씩 얹고 가라고. 혼자 이고 지고 가면 너무 버거우니까. 같이 살자. 
or not. Okay, I thought we should. We're just checking. Is anybody else here? He's telling. I still don't get it. He's the king. He has final words. I don't know what I'm going to do. 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 So he just has to cough. To save her, is that what he's saying? Why doesn't he just tell her that you're the king? You can say no. She's still crying. Well, 
It's like literally, the comment she should have made was not, but the sun is still up. The comment she should have made was, we're outside. <laughs> They're like in the open. <laughs> I swear, this is so much fun. This is like episode three. Like, I'm almost done with episode three now. And. Wow. That was. Honey, more than just a kiss. She go. He's like a love skeptic, and she's a love not skeptic. Love all the way. Stephanie. I'm going. Samsung. He. It's like he left in his PJs, in his pajamas, calling out for a woman, like a woman that the woman he was with earlier is called Samson. Great name, by the way. He was calling out for her, and then the other guy, the Smaller guy, he was like, Wait, if you're going, bring me with you. Like, mm, really? You want to be part of that? She's been working there for like a week. Saving him by degrading him. <laughs> she right there. Oh my god. Don't tell me she's drawing him as well. Yeah, yeah she Everybody are just bad people, like the villain in this thing. Well, like everybody in the palace, except from him, except from the king. It's like that's how it ends. Would have been a good ending to the episode. Become a good king. What's the point then? Come save you. He didn't even show us his inside. Yeah, 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 yeah. 
아그 뭐냐 니께 서방이요 nothing to say i already called it but yeah i mean the dad the dad keeps being an asshole i think he's just yeah i don't like anybody in the palace except for the king he's the only character in the palace that i like and then like i like the other characters some of the side characters some of the minor characters in this show have proven to be like amazing And I think it's sad that they don't have, like, bigger roles. <laughs> like, yeah. In the first in the first two episodes, there were, like, two characters that I just wish would have, like, been, like, r e g I wouldn't have minded that they were minor characters, but if they were just, like, regular characters throughout this show, I, I think that would have really done good. Yeah. But... This episode was not that bad, actually. I think it gets better, uh, like, with the story progressing. So they'll probably, I hope, there will be less for me to comment on. Like, quality-wise, for myself, while watching, I hope it'll keep getting better. But obviously, making videos-wise, that's... sad but i prefer making no videos because there's nothing to say than it being a horrible show no it's funny like there's a lot of fun stuff going on here anyway thanks for watching please stay tuned for the next episode yeah this is gonna be fun i'm gonna have fun so I hope you will too. Pray for no copyright. Anyway, thank you. Goodbye.